Hi everyone, I'm here today to share with you a huge Tuesday, well to me it's a huge Tuesday morning haul and I went to two different Tuesday mornings the other day and um, a couple things are from last week um, but I'm going to do it all in one video. So the first thing I picked up with this 12 by 12 chipboard and it is from, um, it is crepe paper and I think it, it says notes and things. And this totally matches all the, um, the paper in my new paper pad from Michael's The Blush Crush. And um, I just thought for pocket letters and whatnot, I mean, you've got all the, this is the gold. It's got Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday through Sunday, um, you and me, and just a lot of pinks and golds and fun and hello. And I just thought these are perfect. I wish they would have had more. I would have gladly, there's the high, good stuff. Um, pick this up. There's a um, gold, um, look at this. There's a gold focus better clothes pin there just really really cute I love the vintage camera up here and so I just thought that was super cute so for a dollar 99 you can't go wrong and then I picked up this paper pad that is that's called Chanel I guess from American Crafts and um I have never seen or heard of this paper before, and I absolutely love it. It is so much fun. I cannot wait to create with it. I just look at the, the pages are really, really fun. I got two more of the um, crepe paper, the Little Bo Peep. So I got two more of these, and um, I want to make some little minis for people having girls and this this paper looks vintage and I love it absolutely love it I also picked up this Tim Holtz on the edge uh, for $6.99 and I don't have this one and I really do like his on the edge for certain things and for $6.99 I think it will be a lot of fun I think I'll get some use out of that and then here is the Prima Hello Pastel the small stamp set for 49 cents and although they're all cute, I had to get the snail mail, the little envelope. I just thought it was way too cute. And then I picked up, I have some of these that I got at Joann's when they had the Prima stuff. Um, but for 99 cents, normally $5, I just thought these are perfect for pocket letters and whatnot. I love paper clips and my, my planners and... So I got another one and then again I was never into gold so I, I, I only picked up some of the silver collections of these Prima decorative frames but now that I'm doing the gold and pinks and gold and Tiffany blues and pocket letters I thought these would be perfect to accompany so these were a dollar ninety nine so I thought that was a great price so I got two of those and then they had these wood veneer studio calico and this is called is there a name on here well it's the baby one i don't see a name unless it's covered up um but this is all the baby ones so it's got little flowers it's got elephants onesies hearts different shaped hearts little you know, different shaped onesies and so super cute and then I got this um, Petaloo color me crazy clouds um, for a dollar ninety nine they're really thick chipboard and I want to start doing a couple scene cards and um, I also got this studio calico 124 piece wood veneer and this is looks like all hearts I'm not sure what like this round thing is here, but um, oops, sorry, but um, super cute. And then this one here is 39 pieces, and this has um, just all the weather related: the suns, the clouds, the stars, the it looks like snowflakes, all that. So really, really fun. And then I got this um, chipboard pack from Pebbles and again I think the price tag covers up the name um, but here I can show you the front and then it shows you on the back what you get and I think that these can be used for a lot of different um, fun cards and elements so I don't think 
you know, I necessarily need that paper. I love the vintage phone and little tickets and all that. So I got one of those. Actually, I think I got two of those. But anyway, and then I got this. Um, I like the Studio Calico 9 badges. It's like flare, but they're smaller. And I just thought these are just so super cute. Um, that bottom one says always. This snapshots, I just thought super cute. And then I also picked up this Pebbles um, printed cardstock shapes for 4th of July. Um, it's ephemera pack and there's all kinds of stuff. It was $1.49 and I'll flip it. And I like it when they, on the back, they kind of show you what you get. So these are cute too. Lots of little tickets, like the Polaroid ones. So really, really cute to use on all kinds of stuff. And then I also picked up this Pebble die cut cardstock shapes. And these are perfect for uh, pocket letters or whatever, but um, these are cute. And then they show you again on the back. So really, really cute for the price. I love the little index tabs. It's got the Polaroids and that. So um, really, really cute. These were $1.49 as well. It must have been $1.49. And then I picked up, I thought these were super cute for 99 cents. It's the uh, basic Gray Hey You collection. And it's gonna be kind of hard. I'm gonna show you sideways, but these are fabric. And I thought, how much fun to sew on these and have them on cards or layouts or pocket pages. And um, life is grand. Um, here, I can show you here. Nice. A message for you. Well, how about that? The journey is now. Amazing. Noted. And I love these tickets. Are they not the cutest things ever in fabric? I oh, love them. That's pretty much why I got that. And then I got another Studio Calico wood veneer. You get 14 pieces, and this is the frames and kind of the interior of the frames. And I just thought these would be so much fun. Like my uh, paper bag card that I made had the um, Heidi Swap frames like glittered up with gold. And I just thought how much fun to use those little glass beads I bought recently or some glitter, and you could just have fun with those. This I pretty much bought for my granddaughter. She loves to craft now. Every day she comes over, it's, Grandma, let's go craft. And for $1.99, this is the Crate Paper Oh Darling. Um, I don't know what you call it, but just your uh, fun embellishment pieces. And you get all these really cute things. But the little doll sold me, and I thought how much fun for her to play with and create a card or she loves to make books now with my bind it all. That's that's huge for her. And then I got two of these. They have Singer cheesecloth, which is food grade, but they had it in the sewing section. And you get quite a bit, six yards for $1.99. So I got two of those because I'll use it in the kitchen to make pierogies and whatnot. And then I also use it on crafts. Um, and then Martha Stewart, they had one of these stylists, and I really liked it. And for $2.99, I just I thought it was a good deal. It says the regular price is $6.99, so six bucks. So, but it's got the edge there for rub ons, or a lot of times if I'm using hot glue, you know, I think that'll be nice because it's it's it won't stick. It's got the, you know, it repels from the stickiness. And then down here, it's got a stylus and it's got a nice grip to it. So I like that a lot. And then I got this herbs and honey paper from Basic Gray, 36 sheets. And I want to do some recipe, little books or something to that effect. And I just thought this was perfect for that. So really, really cute papers. And a dollar ninety nine, and then I got this really cute tissue because I'm huge into tissue and wrapping and wrapping paper and boxes. And this was uh, two ninety nine, but you get quite a bit. But I love the banners. I'm gonna show it sideways, and then it's got like purple and all, just a ton of different colors. But I just thought the banners were really pretty. And then let's see, I'm gonna do a part two to this. So I've got quite a bit more. So we'll talk to you guys soon in part two. Thanks for watching. Love you. Bye bye.